Hi guys and welcome to today's vlog. If you're new here, I'm Sydney. I'm so happy you're here. I am in my new apartment. I am actually just picking up right where I left off on my empty apartment tour, just moving in and like my process of getting here and everything, um, you know, my road trip and whatnot. So I am gonna pick it up right where I left off and do all things organization. I'm gonna take this through the weekend. It's Thursday right now and I'm going to take it through Sunday likely um, just showing you all the different things um, that I'm doing with my apartment to get organized. I'm hoping by Sunday I'm pretty much organized. Uh, right now I'm headed to the container store to get a couple things. I'm going to do most of my like big hauls like I'm going to do groceries and everything tomorrow uh, just because it's really gloomy and gross out. It's actually like been storming all day so I just want to get the essentials right now. I need some light bulbs. I just need the random little things and a box cutter because I have five trillion boxes that need to be cut down and are broken down and you want to know the last time I broke down a box because I lived in a town home and I would just stack them up in my trash can I'm I'm horrible at breaking down boxes um it, can you be horrible at breaking down boxes I don't know but I am actually I just don't do it so let's head to the container store and then we will get to organizing, get to unpacking, and have a whole weekend ahead of us. Yay! All right, container store done did. I just got a trash can. I'll show you when I get home, of course. And then a shoe rack and some things for boots and some little trash bins. And that was the most overwhelming store I've ever been in in my life, quite frankly, but done did. Hey guys, I just left Target and then I went to True Food Kitchen to grab something to eat for dinner. I will be so honest with you, I have this like balancing up on my um, dash so you can see my screen right here, but I, <laughs> I knew that I was not really great with new fresh starts and everything uh, in a sense that I just, it takes some adjusting and I got like super uneasy, anxious, whatever, um, when I was trying to run errands and I'm just like, oh, I get frustrated because I can walk around Publix, Target, really anywhere from where I'm from, both places where I've been, Michigan and in Alabama, and I know it like the back of my hand. I mean, I've done it so many times that I could just grocery shop with my eyes closed and so being somewhere new where I needed to get different things and park in different spots and like I wanted to get something to eat and I had to go into a parking garage and I'm just like, and then find it in this area and I'm just like, okay, give yourself grace, Sydney, because it's a new beginning. You are gonna get it down and it's normal to feel a little uneasy with fresh starts. So I'm giving myself that grace and I'm just, <laughs> I'm ready to be settled in, in a sense of like, I want, I, I have so many things that I need, um, like just random stuff that you need to furnish your apartment and like, I know I need to run a bunch of different errands and it's so much easier when I'm in Alabama because it's not as busy. And so I can run those errands like that and get them done and here it's like, finding parking and there's a lot of people and I don't know really where anything's at and that's part of it. Soon I'm going to have it all down like nothing but just wanted to say like if you're going through a new move and you're somewhere you've never really been because I have only been to Tampa like a couple times before give yourself grace and let yourself just kind of like go through the motions of something new and a fresh start. I'm going to let myself enjoy this process. All right, here's what I got for dinner. This is my poke bowl, and then this is what I got from Fresh Market? No, Whole Foods, sorry. All I got was stuff for breakfast in the morning. I'm gonna do a big grocery haul tomorrow at Trader Joe's and probably Whole Foods as well, but I just wanted enough to make breakfast in the morning so I didn't have to eat out all the flipping time, but I will enjoy this lovely little poke bowl and get to work. Okay, here's the game plan, baby. I've got um, my headphones, I found my headphones. I was like, I'm not able to work out unless I have headphones, because I know I will be like, I have a million things to do, but I found my headphones, my AirPods, 
And we're gonna go to the gym. I'm gonna go get a little workout in. I just have some biker shorts on and some hokas. I don't even, I think I'm just gonna do like a full upper body workout. So that should be good. And maybe walk a little bit and then I'm gonna go grocery shopping. So for right now, time to go to the gym. I'm excited, a little nervous for a new gym, but um, let's do this thing, baby. I'm obviously not gonna record for my first workout there. Um, I don't even know if you can record there. I'm definitely gonna need to find a gym that you can record if I can't record there. But I'm remembering my reusable grocery bags so that I can um, go right to Whole Foods and Trader Joe's after. I've got my little Brooklyn in one and then also my aloe yoga one. I think I'm gonna grab one more aloe one because I know I've got a lot of groceries to get. And let's head out the door. All right, workout is complete and I'm running into Trader Joe's and Whole Foods now. I'm gonna get some groceries. I'm excited to start cooking at home. Like I feel, it's been fine eating out a little bit of course, but y'all know I love my home cooked meals. I think that I, as I'm more organized and stuff at home, I will feel like more inclined to cook at home, but when it's chaos in there, it's like, the last thing I wanna do is just sit in there and eat a meal. Um, but I'm gonna stock up. I've got a long grocery list, and yes, I will do a grocery haul when we get home. Um, I have so much to stock up on, so it's gonna be quite the haul. I don't know what I'm gonna get here, what I'm gonna get at, Trader, or at Whole Foods, but I'm gonna start at Trader Joe's, knock some stuff out, and then head to Whole Foods. Okay, of course I got an orchid. I love Trader Joe's flowers. So I got a big orchid to have in my kitchen and I got some oat milk. I love the almond milk and um, the oat milk from this brand, the milk brand, obviously. Avocados for avocado toast and some gluten-free bread. I got two different kinds of tea, some frozen fruit, and I'm actually gonna make a smoothie in just a second with my vanilla protein powder. So I just got more protein powder in, uh, and I'm gonna do vanilla with, I think, mango, probably first. Some Simple Mills crackers. I got some cucumbers, uh, some celery, all sorts of greens, some tomatoes, alfalfa sprouts. Um, I really like these on my avocado toast. Some rice cauliflower. I've never tried this vegetable pasta, but I'm, I'm intrigued. I like all things vegetables, so. Green beans, carrots, butternut squash. I'm gonna try these zigzags. They're like, they look like sweet potato fries or crinkle fries. So I'm excited. I might do that with my dinner tonight. And then some normal butternut squash, some quinoa and brown rice, cacao nibs that I want to do in like my oatmeal. And then I've heard good things about this Catalina Crunch. So we're gonna give it a go around. I feel like that would taste good with yogurt or something. I don't know. Um, some Lily's baking chips and some more fruit, salsa, um, so a big thing of rolled oats. And then we've got our proteins over here. So I've got some turkey bacon, some ground turkey, salmon, and then I've got a cod right here, a cod filet right here. Salsa, some different seasonings. I've heard good things about this green goddess seasoning. And then I love the everything but the bagel. And I love the green goddess dressing. So I feel like it's gotta be pretty similar. Some ketchup, some mustard, and of course we need cinnamon, some vanilla, and some stevia. I use stevia every once in a while in a smoothie. And the only other thing I got was I got a bunch of these sparkling waters. So I got the Pellegrino ones, and then I also got Topo Chico. And I think I'm gonna put those in my little wine cooler and have it be like for sparkling water to have every once in a while. I don't drink sparkling water all the time. I feel like I'll like it for every once in a while. So we got quite the grocery haul over here and then also got my protein powder in this morning. So we are stocked up, baby. Oh, I didn't even mention, this is my favorite almond butter. Didn't even say that. Headed back into the container store and I've oh got my myself God. a helper this time. <laughs> Let's hope I don't get wildly overwhelmed this time around. This place is absolutely ginormous, but. We've got a game plan, right? So Yeah. We got a list this time. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we did some serious flipping damage, didn't we? Yeah. Look at this place. So oh my gracious. Stuff everywhere. This is all from the container store. 
we got pretty much everything for the pantry and then a couple things for the fridge. I got these things to put in my tall boots to keep the shape. And then these are for fruit. I got this one. What was this one for? Do we remember? I think just for the, for the um, refrigerator, right? So, yeah. And then this one will be for underneath my sink for makeup. So this will hold like my makeup brushes, some lip stuff, and we'll just mess around with that. This one's for my hair products. And then this is for my... What are they called? Nespresso pods. pods yeah. yeah. And then just a couple random things like lemon squeezer. Will I use it? I don't know. I better. <laughs> and then a spatula. And then over here I got from Crate and Barrel. I think we're going to try and mess around with it up here in this space. And then we also want to try and find a plant that hangs down a little bit. We're going to mess around with it. We're going to figure that one out with these vases. Did you hear walking? like an orange julius too i've just done it with orange juice before but i heard that mango and just vanilla tastes like an orange julius hey, I'm excited. I, don't, I don't want that one mm -hmm. it Taste test reveal. Could you get over here when you're ready? What? Get over here when you're ready and we'll do a taste test. Can I taste like orange Julius? Does it actually taste good or no? Yeah. It's, the more I got into it, it does taste more like orange Julius, actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah. A mango Julius. <laughs> Do you like a big thick slice? I do. Um, did you already do that? I mean, I haven't done yours yet. Oh, it'll finish on. Okay. Are you glad on yours or no show? We might not have patio furniture, but we're still gonna we're still gonna sit out here and have our avocado toast. <laughs> we'll make do until then. That's on our agenda today is to find some patio furniture that's not sold out. Yay. Yum. Oh I didn't notice that. for us to just stay inside and organize so um, we decided instead we're going to the mall aren't we we're yeah, like which um, is also kind of inside but yeah 
Yeah, but it's outside where you walk from yeah. store to store, but shopping's more fun. We'll put it off for later. <laughs> Again. Again. <laughs> Green to 1.5 cucumber, celery, lemon, spinach, kale, parsley, sea salt. So I'm trying to get a lot of liquids in and yeah, I think oil. Okay, we've tackled underneath the sinks in my bathroom. So I just got like toilet paper. I need to put my the rest of my toilet paper under here. And then I've got these towels uh, that I use. They're just like little, they're called Clean Skin Club towels. And they are what I use with my micellar water to take my makeup off. But I've got like some different things. These are like things that I use all the time. So I've got like my um, face wash. I've got some self tan stuff. This is to clean my beauty blender, my micellar water, um, my razor refills, my extra um, toothpaste, and then down here, I don't really know, maybe I'm just gonna, it's just gonna stay unorganized like this and just throw these in here. Um, Cause whatever, honestly, they're just hair ties and I'll put my claw clips in there. And then up here, I've got more stuff that I use all the time. So I've got toothbrush, toothpaste, deodorant. I've got my Laneige lip mask. This lotion that I love, it's by, oh wait, this is my, this is my hair stuff. I've got a lotion thing just like this. So I need to put this with my hair care. Um, I think I got those mixed up. And then I have all of my um, floss things, some perfume. Then I need to put this with my hair care. So coming down here, see I've got these mixed up. Um, here's the lotion that I thought. I had up there so I'm gonna put this in my everyday thing because I use that so much and then I'm going to do this in my hair care one so all of this is hair care and then all of this is my makeup so I can just take out this huge tub and use my makeup I really don't have that much makeup which is nice because it all fits right there and then here's more like skincare stuff um, I've got my, my gua sha in here my new face all of that this is a stainless steel gua sha and it's by skin gym I got it off revolve we've got all my all organized down here and then when you come over here You've got like my trash bin and then my refills of my one a day contacts. Hopefully I don't need those for too much longer because I really want to get LASIK eye surgery. I'm so sick of contacts. But we're done with the bathroom. That feels very, very good. Okay, another little portion organized. So I ordered the wrong size Nespresso pods. I don't know if you, I don't know if I said that, but I ordered the wrong ones. So I only have some of the little ones right now, but I wanna fill this up with the little pods. I think they're just like the single, the single shot of a Nespresso pods. I don't know. And then up here, I'm waiting from Amazon. I ordered a tea organizer. So I'm gonna put all my tea packets in there, but I'm waiting on that. And my mugs up here. Let's just show you around everywhere. Right here I have this nice little spinner. I've got some spices, I've got my stevia, my whatever. Peanut butter and honey. 
I don't really have that many spices, so I don't need like a whole spice setup situation. And then some Ziploc bags up there. And obviously as I'm in here for longer, I'll have more accumulate. Like I just ordered some snackies that will go in there and that will be like my little individual snack thing where I can just grab a snack, run out the door. I've just got my rice right here and then my supplements all down there, my protein powder, my greens and the whole shebang, vitamin D. I've got this Vitex berry and I've got my daily cleanse, all my proteins and each of my greens and my pre-workout back there as well. So then we come into our refrigerator and this looks just so stunning. I do need to go and get some more stuff probably in the next couple of days um, just to stock up on like the basics. But for right now, this is perfect. I've got all of my butternut squash, green beans and cauliflower down here. I've got some more produce in here my milk, and then these are my sisters. My sister loves like sparkling water. And I also have this stocked up just for her because she'll be here all the time. All the shebang. And then I've got some lemons. I probably should put that in a bag, but proteins. I've got cod and my turkey bacon and turkey. More greens right here. And then this looks so gorgeous. My sister's bagels, literally all that girl eats is bagels and cream cheese. That is her love language. I asked her what she would eat for her last meal and she said bagels and cream cheese. Okay then, uh, I do love bagels and cream cheese though. Green Goddess, all of the sauces and dressings up here. Then we move over here and I've got some cups in here and my bowls and plates. I just got these from Crate and Barrel, some new plates, and then the rest is Amazon. And I'll have everything linked on my Amazon storefront, of course, like I always do. And we've been working on this over here, and I think that I'm gonna add this like plank thing that I got from um, William Sonoma, so I need to try that. And I also need to get like a hand soap to go right here, but I thought this looked cute, dish soap. Should I leave that out? I don't know. Um, and then over here, I used to have like my pan and my pot out, but I think I'm just gonna leave it simple like this. Obviously I need to clean up this junk. And I don't know if we have anything over here. This will be my meal prep area. I clearly have more storage than my um, current status needs, but that's okay. Yeah, I literally have nothing over here. I need to put those over in my supplements. So yeah, it's looking pretty dang good, I would say. I'm loving it. Okay, I think I like this a lot better. So I think all I need is some greenery right there. Um, I am gonna have to do some searching for some greenery I like, but we are moving in the right direction. I think that plank looks perfect across, uh, in, my, in my opinion, but I also think that I need something on that side probably some kind of plant or I don't know. I like it simple though. So maybe we'll leave it like this. Maybe I'll bring those books over onto this side. We'll see, but I do like the way that looks. Okay, I'm about to run out the door to go get, I just need to get random things like printer paper and just like not very exciting things. But I figured I would end off today's vlog. I'm basically doing like a vlogmas type thing style where you do like Okay, not Vlogmas, you guys get the point though. I'm trying to like end off a vlog and then start right from there and continue on um, vlogging just because I want to like have all of this documented and like show you guys literally the whole process of everything. Um, so that being said, I figured once this is getting long, I pick up the next one and like show you guys the progress of stuff. Hope you guys like this much content and like this much like in-depth stuff. Um, let me know like if you want to see different things, of course, let me know. Um, but like getting into finding new coffee shops that I like here, new restaurants that I like and just all of the things. I'm excited to show you guys as I already am. Like I think that we knocked out a ton. Uh, I still have lots like tomorrow. I'm going to show you guys. I got all, a bunch of new Lululemon stuff and then um, yeah, this is a hot mess. And then like some PR over there and then just like random stuff I've got going on here. So I will show you guys all that tomorrow, which will be in the next vlog. But this outfit right here, what are we thinking? What do we think? I never thought I would throw a onesie on in my entire life. I didn't think that I would ever put on an Align onesie, but I have the perfectly oversized crew tied around 
We're still working on this tie. I don't really know how I like it. And then I have the onesie, Align onesie in a size six. I sized up one compared to what I get in my Align shorts and they're perfect fit like this. So I'm glad that I sized up a little bit. I didn't even try it on before I left. I knew that the Align bra and the Align um, tank is normally very tight on me. So I get a size six in that. And then I have, this is actually a men's bag from Bottega and I just got it, but it's, well, I got it uh, a couple weeks ago, but it's like kind of like an athletic looking bag, if you ask me, I love it. And then I just have my slides on. Um, so yeah, I don't know what we think about the onesie, but I think I like it with this style of an outfit. And then I also got like some new sneakers. So we'll do a haul, more of like a haul style in my um, next vlog of what I got. And I will have, I'm knocking out a bunch tonight with organization I showed you guys for the most part, but I really want it to feel a little more homey and a little more clean in here. By tomorrow, let's pray we start the week off, like, you know, with some organization. So it's Saturday, tomorrow's Sunday, we can knock out a bunch, I know we can. Um, but I love y'all, I love sharing this with you guys. I have never done like multiple vlogs in one week really. So this is new for me, but I love it. I feel like we're just hanging out, we're just chilling. And it's been a dream being here. I'm only on like day, what, like two and a half? And I love it so much. And seeing my sister as much as I did was amazing. I'm done rambling. I love y'all and I'll see y'all tomorrow. Well, you know, I'm gonna keep going tomorrow.